All right, so it's um, <clears throat> what day is it? November eighteenth. It's November eighteenth, so it's almost Thanksgiving time. Uh, Mike, my manager from Cycle Gear, and I are about to head out to a motocross track about an hour away, get some riding in. So um, got my trusty Kawasaki KX two fifty here, and uh, I don't get a whole lot of free days to ride, so I'm gonna take advantage of this Sunday and go get some laps in on the moto track. <clears throat> about to go riding. Um, Actually, not put it. No, no, I don't need to. I'm gonna put another sweatshirt on because you see that beautiful 6D helmet right there? So nice. Best helmet you can get. 10 out of 10. Would recommend to everyone. Come on, you can do it. You I got it. it. I got her. It's a new dirt bike hate to live a ride. It's an ant. You can load it. I don't want you to go to college. X. I got straps, homie. Where? I already put your straps oh, on. I ain't ahead of you. I got your back. Almost pulled a collar. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, we drove through the middle of Arkansas and now we're in some little motocross tracks. I haven't been to it in years, but um, looks like there's some new owners and they changed it quite a bit since I've been here last time, so gonna get some riding in. Um, see how it goes. It's pretty pretty chilly though. So I'm gonna play her up some more. Get on track. Got some new spandex. These are my new moto pants. Like this is all I'm wearing. Just skin tight. X gives you excellent mobility. X go give it to you. Wait for you to get it on your own. No, just kidding. These are actually these new moto skis, adventure short, uh, adventure tights. That's what they are. They're actually super awesome. You get the pad in the back. They like go all the way down. Really good if you're sitting up and standing down, uh, like a motocross sort of thing. So, super stoked that moto skis hooked me up with these. Wore them once for the first time last week. I'm gonna use them again this week because they're awesome. I've got like four layers on. It's pretty cold. But uh, nonetheless, I've got my bristers, my winter gloves. 60, sweet 60 helmet. Going right! Mike, Mike's got his uh, Hayden Schultz sponsored bell. That I yeah, my sponsorship I bell. I had a bell flex. Mother nine laying around. Like, Mike, you need help. Yeah, he said, Keep you're too fast to not wear a That's helmet. That's right. Yeah. And I'll see broke also. So he hooked me up. He's a yeah, sponsor. He trade, and then I proceeded to wreck what I traded for the next time I used it. Traded them for some Dionysian boots. And then I crashed into a guardrail on a private track the next time I rode. So I didn't get the value I was hoping for out of it, but they did save me for one crash. Well, first of all, this is some of the best dirt I've ever ridden on. Like, awesome dirt, so the berms have a lot of grip. You can just go in there hard, blow them out. The track's awesome. The jumps are pretty good. There's no like really big jumps or anything like that, but uh, they're all pretty jumpable. Um, they're still uh, big enough that like you feel like you jump something, and uh, you build your confidence, and it uh, feels pretty good. Uh, even though considering it's a little misty and cold, like the track's awesome so far. I mean, Mike, what do you think of the track? Like, pretty sweet. Yeah, yeah it's great. Yeah, dirt. Mike would go perfect. In. Yeah, it's a. Uh, it's not too hard packed, but it's not 
slushy either. Yeah, I know. They did a good job prepping it. Yeah. So it's a perfect amount of sand. Yeah. And I'm like, like I said, I'm not a very good motocross. I grew up motocrossing, but boy, I uh, don't claim to be no professional on the dirt. But uh, it's uh, good to get on the track and actually get on a pretty good track. And um, considering this is out in the middle of nowhere in Arkansas, this is probably like a, one of the better unfound gems of the south. Little track, nothing super big or anything, but really good layout. Um, nothing hard or complicated, but still fast enough to where like you can like. I don't know, you think you can, if there's fast guys and slow guys, not just like blitz it down a straightaway, make a turn and keep on going, like you'll be able to differentiate and stuff, so. We're gonna keep riding and uh, throw some gnarly whips and. We got the whole track to ourselves. Yeah, so. we're the only people that showed up all day long. Unfortunately. So, so yeah, we got the whole track to ourselves for another hour, so. I eat healthy so I got my chicken and some rice and vegetables because see that get a good look Mike stopped at Sonic on the way here but I can't do that anymore my problem is for Rouge I'm pretty fat so it's funny because he's fat <laughs> dang <laughs> <laughs> he's not wrong so I gotta uh, get my diet better and uh try to eat healthy if I'm gonna keep road racing so I don't waste so much because you know you go down a straightaway and you got some kid that you got 20 pounds on you're gonna blow your doors off so that's what I'm doing gotta look more like Michael that model jockey physique <laughs> <laughs> perfect bike model just like <laughs> all right Unfortunately, Colin missed it, but uh, I just stuffed Mike right here in this berm, and uh, I set him up pretty good. I then I thought he was gonna get me back, but I couldn't. Couldn't pull the trigger because he's too nice. Whatever. <laughs> he's slow. Mike just finished up his last moto, and so yeah, it was a good day riding. Uh, probably one of the better days of riding I've had in a while. It was fun. So, it didn't come back out here. The only bad part is it's almost like December, so you know, a whole lot of tracks are going to be open. So, um, glad to get some weather or get some riding while the weather was still nice. Nice enough to ride anyway because it's still pretty cold. But, uh, man, the problem is now you got that itch to go ride more, and so all you want to do is ride, but it's uh, so cold that you don't get the so yeah thanks uh south of the south of the ozarks mx for staying open for us because we we're the only people that showed up all day and they're about to close down and we rolled up so glad we got some uh riding in and the track's awesome so if you if you get the chance to come out here to south of the ozarks uh motocross down in uh i don't even know what town in arkansas it is but it's somewhere down here in the ozarks so go there <laughs> even though probably smoke his both on their bike oh yeah I'm too short. All right, jump up there. I got it. All right, let's go. Well, I uh, just got home and I am absolutely whooped. So I'm gonna go shower and go to bed and hang out for a little bit. But thanks for coming along. This is a little bit different vlog, like vlog style video than uh, some of our others that were a little more serious. But uh, it was fun. Good day of moto. So uh, 
let us know what you think if you like this style more or um, just like get your feedback um, I had fun making this video it's a fun day so uh, hopefully we can get back to the motor track soon and uh, get some more riding in this winter um, just go out training in ready for next year all that but uh yeah shout out to mike for driving us down there and uh hanging out and uh everybody that makes it possible it was a good day and uh see y'all later